me and Super Sorrel Jr. picked up something cool. <laughs> Stick around to the end of today's video to see what we picked up, and let's go shopping!
You can probably see what it is <laughs> so there i got a little delivery this came from poundfun.co.uk check out poundfun.co.uk they're a new one to me um i checked it out because i thought well, i'll check out the website and uh, there's a lot of cool di discounted toys on there and uh, i'll open those in a bit but you did see from this from the first part of the video that we did go on a toy hunt today and i did go to entertainer and me and Super Sorrel Jr. picked up something cool. <laughs> now, this is something a little bit different for the channel, but I'm excited. I had to grab this. As soon as we saw it, I had to get it. Ugh. Those of you that know me know that I, I, I collect action figures. I collect a bit of all sorts, but I also like dolls, as you can see from up there. I do have a lot of dolls in my collection, including Monster High and all sorts of cool stuff. But I saw these, and this is my aesthetic. I love it. <laughs> so yes, this is the LOL dolls, but this is the Movie Magic series, and this is heavily influenced by Grease, which is one of my favourite musicals of all time. So they're definitely going for the Sandy look with her, and Tough Guy is definitely meant to be Danny. They have 100% like gone for that aesthetic. And the fact that they both have little leather jackets and she's got two outfits. You can put her in the uh, sort of black leather leggings kind of thing. A bit just like, you know, the end of the movie with um, you know, with Sandy and Danny and stuff. So it, it is a really cool little set. And it's something a little bit different that I've never I've never touched on LOL dolls really. I did that arcade cabinet recently and I wasn't a fan because they're like the tiny little baby dolls and they did nothing for me. Uh, I thought the arcade cabinets would be cool, but I was kind of disappointed with them. But these are bigger versions of the dolls, and these look awesome. These are about the same size, I believe, as like a Rainbow High, which again, I like the, I like the look of some of those Rainbow Highs as well. But anyway, so we're gonna. I'm definitely wanting to unbox this one. Take a have a look at have a look at her stuff. So stay tuned on the channel. Me and Super Soul Junior will be opening this together because Super Soul Junior is stupidly excited to break into that. <laughs> <laughs> you know my my child doesn't realize how lucky she is sometimes because obviously she's got two parents me and mrs super Zorro, who both toy hunt on the regular and buy ridiculous amounts of toys so our house is literally littered with toys and then of course i i, I went to the, the uh i went to pound fun and they had capsule sheiks back in stock and these were all marked down to six quid each which six pounds a piece you can't go wrong at. So I got one of each, the ones that we did. What was that? Oh no, one of my dobs. Yeah. I dropped Roxanne. <laughs> Roxanne from Goof from the Goofy movie just went flying. How what even sent her flying then? I don't even understand. Um <laughs> so anyway, back back to this. So we got three capsule sheiks. We got Hollow Glow. We got Giga Glam. Now, I never did Giga Glam because we bought this one, but Super Sorrel uh, Jr. and Mrs. Super Sorrel opened it on Mrs. Super Sorrel Shorts channel. So I never actually got to open this one. And then I believe this one is Control Alt Magic. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Control Alt Magic. So with the two that I got the other day, because I did get some more the other day, We've got one of each again to try. So we've got all five to unbox on the channel again. So stick around. I will be posting up videos of all these real soon because these are these are cool. I love these ones. These are like Japanese gashapon machines. And what doll you get is random. That's why I love them. So every time you get one of these, it's a slightly different doll. And I do actually have one over here, actually. Because I've been putting, I've been using this doll with the arcade cabinet from LOL Dolls. So I think she looks awesome. So I can't wait to get some more pieces um, to add to that collection. Because like I said, all the hair pieces and all the, the costumes and that are all interchangeable. 
So I love I love them kind of lines where you can customize. That's why I like these zombies because they're the same. You can swap and change the hairs and things like that. But yes, stick around. What are you most excited for me to unbox first? Danny and Sandy from the LOL Dolls <coughs> or the Capsule Sheiks. I know this is something a little bit different to what, from what I usually unbox on the channel, but <laughs> I've got to say, I'm enjoying what I'm unboxing right now. I'm, I'm enjoying what I'm doing, uh, as well as all the block, you know, the, all the Roblox stuff, you know, the, 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 the uh, blocks fruits, um, doors, and Five Nights at Freddy's, and creepy cats, and, uh, uh, you know, the, 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 Deddy bears and all that cool stuff over there as well. All, all the blind boxes I'm enjoying doing, and these these are just another version of like a blind box to me. So, and again, so same with the lol stuff. There's like random surprises and stuff you can get in lol dolls things. So <coughs> it all it all it's just that little surprise toys thing for me, and that's what I love. So, hope you guys are happy with what I've bought. I hope you guys are excited to see what I do with it. See me unbox them. And just thank you all very much for watching. As always, I'm your host, Soup Sorrel. I'll see you in the next video. But until then, may the force be with you.